Thanks. 14 families moving out of their apartments right now. This early morning fire in South Tulsa at the Eagle Point Apartments left them without a home. 2 News reporter Liz Bryant joins us now live where it took firefighters about an hour to put out the fire. Liz? Yeah, you're right, Russ. And firefighters are blaming this destruction on faulty electric wiring. They say wiring shorted out between you can see the first and second floors traveling up the walls and into the attic. That's why there's no roof. Now, apartment managers let residents back inside here today to get what's left of their belongings and move to another apartment the company owns. Sarah and Joel Katz are like most people here who don't have renter's insurance. Sarah's sister help her, helped her move out. As you can see, this is the same sister who woke up in the middle of the night with a gut feeling she needed to turn on her cell phone. Within five minutes, she says Sarah called her saying her apartment's on fire. Knowing that we're not alone, knowing that we don't have to do anything alone and that everything's going to be okay. If you hold too much value in what you have, it can be more of a burden to you. Sarah says her neighbor who lives across this parking lot alerted her of the fire. That neighbor also went door to door pounding on the doors to wake everyone up. You can also see that crews this afternoon set up this fence to make sure no one gets close to the dangerous building after everyone got their belongings out. Crews are set to demolish this building. Live in South Tulsa, I'm Liz Bryant. Two News works for you.